Yes. Joy and sorrow, happy and sad, and all the polarities, infatuation, resentment, admire, despise, seek, and avoid are all impulsive and instincts of our lower amygdala. The ones that are most inspiring that call us, leave us not in a state of uncertainty, leave us in a state of clarity and certainty. Those inspired states bring tears of grace to our eyes. Those are the ones that you want to guide your life by. And I believe that when we get into those values that you just said, the highest values, our highest values, we unleash or illuminate our conscience. That's it. We start, and we start living a life of conscience. We start leading as a leader in a company from a place of conscience. We don't need extrinsic. The word government comes from governmentist, one who can govern their own mind. And when you're in an executive center, you govern your own mind. You don't need extrinsic moralities to guide you. That's for people that don't have governance over themselves, run by amygdalas, looking for impulses and immediate gratifications. You have an intrinsic system that automatically exemplifies the highest self-actualized morality of life. Wow, Dr. Demartini. Listen, I, I can't wait to listen to this podcast myself after the production is done with this and go through it again. I feel like there's so many aha moments that can be taken from this and you slide them in very succinctly and carefully and they're rich and meaningful and Wow, thank you for being on the show today. Oh, thank you for the show. Thank you for your insights and thank you for your, your great questions.